Hi, I'm Martijn Otten from AV Logic. Today I'm here with the SAM 2.0 automatic flexor plate mounting machine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to create a job, apply tape and actually mount a plate. So it's actually super easy. I'm in my easy mount uh, software overview. Uh, I start with selecting the right repeat. In this case, it's uh, 610 millimeters. Um, then I use the cameras, uh, sorry, the uh, encoders of the machine to position the cameras. So what I need to do is I need to make sure I get my uh, mounting marks in the field of view. So here we go, for my left mounting mark. Get my right mounting mark. Then I measure the plate, so that's actually going to measure the distance between the mounting marks. You will see the number filled in. is 1103.635 millimeters, so really down to the micron. Uh, you also get a visual feedback of that plate. So it's a one-piece plate, um, one across, one around, but you can of course select uh, multiple plates. Uh, I want to do an eight-color job. So basically what I do is I select create job and mount, uh, and then I'm ready to go. But however, first I want to uh, apply the tape. So I press knife. I've got a piece of tape that's pre-cut, as you can see, to the right uh, length. Apply that to the, uh, to the sleeve. There we go. And I use the pressure roller of the machine to mount that tape without any air inclusions. What I want to do is I want to make sure there's no more tension in the tape so you don't uh, get any creasing. And then using the foot pedal, rotating the sleeve. And uh, yeah, as you see, it's very easy and quick to apply this uh, tape. So I put my pressure roller back up. I bring my sleeve back to the center position. Now I want to make sure there's a bit of an overlap. And what I'm going to do is use my uh, cutting knife here, the rotary ceramic blade. And that's going to cut through the two layers of tape. Very straight because it's mounted on the, on the camera beam of the machine. No damage on the sleeve. Reason is it's a ceramic blade that's rolling over the sleeve and it also has an adjustable uh, cutting depth. Very easy and safe uh, tool actually. So now I peel off the overlapping part and since the ceramic blade is actually mounted on an angle, you get a perfect seam butt to butt join. As you can see here, Then I remove the liner. Again, I can use the, uh, the foot pedal to rotate the sleeve. There we go. Now create job and mount. That will bring me to the to the mounting screen. You can see there's an eight color job uh, and one plate per sleeve. Press next plate, brings me to my first plate. You will see the cameras are moving automatically to the right position. The front table will move down and underneath the mounting marks for optimal image recognition. And what I do then is I take my plate. I have laser pointers attached to the cameras to indicate roughly where I should position uh, the mounting marks. Once I have them in the field of view of the cameras, the image recognition system will turn on the vacuum and the robotic positioning of that plate. We're actually seeing the plate being moved by the robotic mounting table until it's within five micron uh, positioning accuracy. The cylinder will come up automatically and the pressure roller will come down. First it's going to rotate my direction to mount the top part of the plate. Rotate the other direction to mount the bottom part of the plate. And the beauty of automatic mounting is after this plate is mounted. Uh, it's going to do an automatic quality check. So it's going to go back to the mounting marks and verify for the operator and also downstream processes 
that the plate was mounted correctly. So it gives me the okay. And that's it. So that's my plate uh, mounted. First color done. Notice we use a cantilever system for optimal uh, space saving and ergonomics. And are you ready to mount your next color? So thank you for your time. I hope that was uh, insightful. Take care.